Hello my love and welcome to today's Gas Me Up Tarot Reading. Today I am going to be gassing you all the way the fuck up. I already know some love messages are going to be coming through in this reading as well and everything that you need to hear that's going to lift your spirit. Pick whichever image you are drawn to. It's all the timestamps will be in the description box below and I will meet you there. Hello my love and welcome to your reading. I hope and intend all is well with you and those you love we are gonna go ahead and get right into it i actually really i think i say this for every pile that i love your picture and i am the one that picks the pictures but still like i love this fucking picture so we're definitely going to talk about it because you are in your divine feminine essence right now. You are in your divine feminine bag right now. Things might be seeming very easy to you at this time or your psychic and intuitive abilities are just on another level right now. And they are going to continue to be, baby, because you are just so, so, so tapped in specifically with source energy. You and source are definitely co-creating at this time and you guys are co-creating magic there's also an element here of you being very mysterious and nobody being able to read you they see you as very beautiful though and they see you also as somebody that's very intricate or something about your style you always look a little different you could also like to wear a lot of black but even though you are kind of in the dark or you wear darker colors you still radiate such beautiful light and a lot of people are thinking right now that wow i love the way this person thinks i love their mind your mind is absolutely gorgeous and you're really thinking outside of the box at this time and it's capturing a lot of attention also whatever it is that you got going on whatever you're creating is capturing a lot of attention and people are really getting stuck on you and are also very addicted to your energy it's something about you that is extremely alluring extremely magnetic and everybody wants to be a part of whatever it is that you are creating or whatever it is that you got going on and you're also the type of person my love where it's like you don't really have to say too much your vibration does the talking or the end result does the talking for you you might like to create or make moves in silence and then when the final product is ready it's like this beautiful magnificent masterpiece and you're like okay let me put it out into the world or it's time for people to see and then people when people see they're like oh my god and don't even know like when you even had time to do this or how this came about but lo and behold behind the scenes you and god were working on it the whole time so right now baby i want to tell you that your manifestation abilities and your ability to create are at an all-time high you're getting crown chakra activations third eye activations and your feminine essence is just spewing out of you you are very attractive at this time very magnetic at this time and anything that you would like to call into your life anything that you would like to do this is the perfect time for you to go ahead and get that motherfucking shit done okay because it's going to turn out even better than you expected and the universe is working in your favor and people are just really intrigued by whatever it is that you're doing people are intrigued by you baby and everything is okay if there's any worries that you're having at this time this is a really good time for you to surrender those worries those concerns to god and just let go flow and trust anything that's really heavy on your mind this is a time for you to not worry about things and kind of just know and trust that there is going to be a divine result or a divine solution that comes from the situation and there's no need for you to worry baby the universe got your back everything is good and <laughs> whatever you're doing at this time definitely keep going definitely keep doing it whatever you're creating if you're having like rituals or manifestation routines or a journal routine morning routine any routine that you're doing in order to keep your vibration high maybe spiritual baths as well like 
whatever you're doing keep up the good work and whatever you're creating in the physical as well because i'm getting two energies of you creating on the spiritual plane and then you also creating something on the physical plane and they're kind of like both tying into one another they're both connected whatever it is that you're doing keep doing it because it's literally blossoming beautiful results and the final creation is going to be stunning also oh i just <laughs> i just heard as well that that pussy got power okay and i also want to tell you that there is this energy of you at this time connecting all the dots connecting your past present and future understanding why certain things happened in the past so that in the future they could work out like you're kind of putting it all together at this time or very soon you're going to be able to connect the dots about why everything happened the way it did and it's going to be like a big aha moment but either way baby right now you are just coming across as so divine so mysterious and somebody that has a very 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 beautiful mind but somebody who is also very protected and if you ever come and go from certain situations whenever you're not around you really stay on people's minds and they wonder where they are where she at what's she doing um what is she currently up to what is she creating because people know that you are very meticulous and that you don't stay in one place right now you got people stuck in your web and you're just so 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 attractive so we're gonna start this off with some dice and the tarot deck that we're using today for this reading is the romantic tarot this is what spirit requested okay along with the the web and the romantic tarot there is definitely somebody who is stuck on you and right now you seem to be doing your own thing you're creating and manifesting your own life for your individual self and as you're doing this people are just in awe but there's one or two specific energies here that is like i said stuck on you they want a part of whatever it is that you got going on all right so let's start it off with some dice and then we're gonna get tarot and see what's up for pure fall one spirit let's get it let's go all right there's a dick over here there is literally a dick over here so this might be somebody that dicked you down all right they're still watching you this person is lovesick over you definitely this could be somebody that is toxic though did you have like toxic dick in your life i don't know but <laughs> but i feel like they're sick because they're no longer with you and they're watching you continue to level up i don't know if you've ever seen those tiktoks where it's a guy and it's from the guy's perspective and it's like pov when the girl you ghosted or fumble just keeps getting badder and badder baby that is you you are the gift that keeps on giving you just continue to level up you continue to make moves you continue to be in your bag and whoever it is that you're no longer talking to or that you know you're kind of like i guess like a no contact situation or maybe they were like a little toxic devil dick type of vibe this person is definitely still watching you but they're like sick they're like oh how could i let this go or how could i not get right with this person if that's not your story what this is giving is that there's people that want to have sex with you but be warned all right you have a lot of eyes on you at this time you're receiving a lot of attention because of how you look and just your energy overall your energy is very other like i want to say otherworldly but it's just not very common and it's also dark so there's an intrigue about it it's a little bit of siren energy mixed with coquette energy that means like you're very hot and cold you're on and off but when you're on you give this experience and this type of attention that people don't really get anywhere else plus the way you put yourself together overall the way you present yourself is extremely alluring so people tend to get very addicted to what you bring to the table which is just you naturally but it's rare there are many energies of the opposite sex who want to give it to you point blank period they want to lock it down <laughs> you're making people's hearts light up and i also feel for somebody that you had sex with you have triggered their heart into some sort of healing 
this was a person that didn't necessarily want to commit or they just had wounds from past relationships and now after they run into you they have been triggered into healing and this could be a painful process for some people but they feel stuck on you they feel like you're theirs a lot of people feel like you are their soulmates so let's get some tarot here and see what the fuck is going on luck is definitely on your side at this time yeah you're doing your own thing and you're minding your own business and whoever it is that you recently moved away from it doesn't have to be just somebody that dicked you down but <laughs> or somebody that you dicked down or gave it to put that good good on them right um you know you're doing your own thing and the people that you are currently moving away from or you know you're transitioning into the next level the people that you're transitioning away from moving on from they are thinking about you they're wondering about you and they are also feeling like you are different so continue to follow your intuition as well baby because like i said your intuition your crown chakra is spot on at this time and you are really guiding the way for yourself you have been in this planning mode and i'm here to tell you that whatever plans that you got going on for yourself are going to go out without a hitch once you kind of take action and make your moves you are definitely stepping into some sort of leadership position if you have been wondering if somebody still thinks about you or if somebody misses you yes they do specifically if this person is a smoker when they smoke they tend to reminisce but for my viewer continue on the path that you are currently on you're about to level up and about to move in a new direction based on whatever you've been planning and your plans are going to be very successful once you take this action and you're going to be in an upgraded position and be receiving more money okay you're definitely a trendsetter as well <clears throat> And that's why the universe is putting you in this position to lead others and also give you some sort of public platform or you're being seen by a lot of people in some way, shape or form. We have a lot of fire energy. These three cards are fire. So this is also telling me that you're a very creative individual and you're very original. So whatever it is that you're creating, like I said already, but whatever it is that you're creating, it's going to be seen and loved and admired by many, many people. And you're going to be reaching a new audience soon. This doesn't have to be just on social media. This could be just in your regular life, but this is a part of your destiny, baby. Let me turn up the lights a little bit. Hold on. So keep doing what you're doing. The world has definitely never seen or experienced anyone like you before. And you are a standout everywhere that you go. Okay, there's truly nobody like you. And your intuition at this time is leading you to complete wealth, generational wealth, and a lot of motherfucking money. And at this time, you may be on your own, but as you continue down this path, path there is going to be a long-term stable committed relationship with another person right now there's a lot of people who want you people are very 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 sexually attracted to you now you don't really give sexual energy in a very traditional way you're not like a megan fox or a marilyn monroe but still you're very appealing in your own right and people fantasize about you straight up people fantasize about you and really heavily think about coming towards you and what it would be like to you know get a little freaky deaky with ya this is what the people that are looking at you are currently thinking there's something about you that is like oof. You just have a extreme sex appeal about you, but it's not in a traditional way. It's in an unconventional way. And this makes you even more of a hot commodity, baby. And there is a fire sign at this time who is completely and totally focused on you. As for you, baby, whatever it is that you've been investing your energy into and focusing on, continue to work at it because it is going to bring you riches so believe in yourself and keep going now there's many options that you have that you could choose from at this time but there's a specific person definitely coming through here for sure 
the channeled song that I'm hearing is Fire and Desire by Drake, where Drake is like, tell me should I cut these other girls right out of my life because we never decided. So whoever you're dealing with, this could have been you as well because I'm getting that both of you are very attractive in your own ways and both of you have multiple options. With that being said, my viewer, you seem like somebody who is very focused on having a very prosperous future and you're on the path to that, so kudos to you. But whoever it is that you're dealing with, their main focus is you, but sometimes they tend to get a little distracted or they get a little confused when it comes to all these different options going on. Like they get caught up and this is somebody that might have been a player or just a little less mature than you. You definitely have a much higher maturity level. Again, your mind is so gorgeous and just the way that you think and operate is beautiful. You've also done a lot of shadow work and I want to congratulate you for coming as far as you have come baby because you have really blossomed and this is really only the beginning for you so that's why i'm encouraging you to keep going and also make decisions that are in alignment with your desires and be fearless there is nothing for you to have fear about or worry about and take the actions needed to be taken at this time because i promise you it's going to bring and yield very beautiful results and a lot of success so anything that you have personally been contemplating definitely go ahead and do it now when it comes to this person they are a past player like i said you have triggered this person into ascension you have triggered them into healing and they kind of go back and forth though they have their main focus and attention on you for sure but they don't know how to fully stabilize being in like a higher energy just as yet so i feel like that's why spirit is like continue on with your life continue on with your personal stability if this person can't get it right somebody else will right but don't put your life on hold for anybody okay it's also about you rejecting people who are not honoring your worth or your value if they can't act right that's not your problem because the next person will okay you're looking real good that coin is about to be better than ever there's some sort of increased attention or success that's coming in that's really going to stabilize a lot of the things that you've been creating in this in the spiritual realm you're about to see your manifestations manifest in the physical and i actually be grounded it's not going to be a dream anymore and whatever you take certain inspired action baby things are going to be better than you even thought they would be and this is a journey where it's okay if you do it alone it's okay if you do it with a little fear because Along the way, all of the right people are going to meet you there and people are really going to take to whatever it is that you're putting out there or whatever it is that you're doing and you're going to help a lot of people and you're going to make a lot of money. So keep going. The support is available to you. Right now, the universe is supporting you, but the universe is also going to show you love and support through other people. Okay, baby? The other channeled song coming through is You Make My Earthquake. <laughs> Oh, you make my earthquake. It's for you. Let's gas the viewer up. Let's get it. We have paradigm shift. Yeah. The new experience is integrating now. Okay. Materialization. So yeah, whatever it is that you're manifesting, that shit is about to fully materialize. Just know that change and expansion is on the way. And it's happening. It's happening. Whatever it is that you and spirit have been conjuring, you and the universe have been conjuring it's happening and on the bottom of the deck we have go for it so definitely now is the time to step out of your comfort zone and do those plans that you have made it's all in alignment what else what else what else and then we have heart and mind union another beautiful thing about you is that you have a very beautiful vibration your vibration is very high right now and this is like you actually taking action on your inner visualizations and things again fully materializing on the earth plane and you're just living your best fucking life so i'm so happy for you everything is working out in your favor and just know that things are manifesting for you quickly 
quickly you're already an amazing manifester but you're becoming even better so continue to do the things that bring you peace just know that you got it you got it girl you got it oh what the fuck a lot of change is coming your way so this is the final message this is just going to be a little self-love reminder for you some advice from the cosmos let's see what we got here let's get it and i really hope this reading did gas you up baby you are on the right path you're doing everything correctly your manifestations are coming to fruition they're going to be better and bigger than you even expected or visualized and again the universe is working in your favor this is your time to shine and just know that money is not an issue any resource that you need is not an issue go for it you got this so much people are going to love and support whatever it is that you're doing people are already very intrigued by you overall and in terms of your love life yes that man is still motherfucking focused on you he has not let you go but He's not quite on your level just as yet. So do what you will with that information, but don't stop your life or put your life on hold for anyone, okay? What does this say? It says, God chose you for this battle. Be brave. So whatever it is that you're going through, God chose you specifically for. I don't think it's a battle, so to speak, but just like be brave and do your thing. Do your thing, thing. And then it says, never let the sadness of your past and the fear of your future ruin the blessings of your present moment. So we're not letting anything hold us back. And also as you take action and as you become that person you want to be now in the present moment you're gonna change your future all of it's connected remember you're gonna be able to connect those dots pretty soon and you're gonna look back and be like oh my god this is amazing don't set yourself on fire to keep other people warm so this is your reminder right now to just do you focus on you and do what you need to do in order for you to get to that place that you want to be at and i promise you you're gonna get there and you're gonna be more successful than you even imagined okay baby there are gonna be people that you have to leave behind or that are simply just not in alignment with where you're going and that is okay that is okay don't lower yourself to suit others especially because you're meant to go so high and you're really meant to soar and thrive and there will be the right people at that next level for you so there is no need to hold yourself back or dim your light in order to please people who aren't even meant to go where you're going okay okay thank you so much for watching leave me red hearts if you watched all the way through like this video and subscribe i will talk to you later peace hello my love and welcome to your reading i hope and intend all is well with you and those you love we're gonna go ahead and get right into it okay so i'm actually really excited for your reading because i felt the energy of your pile when i was actually making and creating the thumbnail and picking the pictures and for you baby your energy at this time is going through such a upgrade and the universe and your spirit guides are really working on your behalf behind the scenes to bring about this really magical experience for you as well as physical upgrades and just transition you into a new phase of your life and this is simply all happening because of your faith and your belief in yourself and in your desires so there is not much that you have to do at this time other than continue to have faith and believe and if there's something that you feel inspired to do or an action that you feel inspired to take of course do that but what i'm really getting from this pile is that the universe and your spirit guides are working overtime behind the scenes on your behalf this reading is timeless so whenever you're watching you're watching at the perfect time but by the next full moon or this the the next full moon after this full moon like one full moon and then another full moon that's the time frame for you my love and by that time you're gonna see such a big change and such a big difference in the life that you're living and also in the clothes that you're wearing so for this pile 
to gas you up babe your faith and your belief in yourself and your desires is what is fueling the manifestation and there is definitely going to be some spotlight on you and i'm also picking up on the fact that whatever it is that the universe and your spirit guides are curating for you behind the scenes this is shit that is only for you nobody else is getting this these are blessings that are for you specifically the channel song coming through is grace by little baby and 42 doug little baby says in the song everything that i got was made for me i was serving the trap houses faithfully so i don't know if y'all in the trap <laughs> but take it as a metaphor it doesn't necessarily have to mean that you guys are in a trap but it's like whatever you're doing similar to cinderella cinderella had certain tasks you know, her stepmother assigned her certain tasks. And even though they were kind of like nitty gritty shit, she did that shit. She had faith and optimism that, you know, one day her heart's desire would come true. She had strong belief in that. And boom, it did. And that song, Everything That I Got, It Was Made For Me, also very similar to Cinderella and the shoe type of energy. It's like that shoe was the right fit for specifically Cinderella. Her stepsisters tried to put their big ass motherfucking feet up in that shit and it wasn't working. It's very similar for the blessings that are going to be unfolding for you. There could be je jealousy and evil eye that comes with these newfound blessings, but that doesn't matter. You are divinely protected and these blessings are being given to you from God. So know that there is no need to worry about any jealousy or evil eye or anything like that. There is such magnificent abundance. So this is an increase in money this is an increase in clothing an increase in your personal status out here in these motherfucking streets okay an increase in attention that you receive maybe some of you are getting new cars as well this is the type of blessings that are coming your way and it's a beautiful transformation it's also a permanent transformation this is things that you don't have to worry about losing you're going to have it forever it's like your life will never be the same so we're gonna get started with some dice and then i'm gonna pull tarot for you your love life is changing as well or you could be meeting somebody that you're going to feel like you've known them for a long long time either way transformation season is afoot for you and like I said, all you got to do is remain positive, remain faithful, remain optimistic and keep believing in your dreams. Keep believing in your desires because I promise you sooner than you think these things will be fully manifested and materialized. So let's go ahead and get these dice and gas you up a little bit more, baby. Did I not say money? Ka-ching, ka-ching. Ka-ching, ka-ching. Let me see what's over here. Ooh, we got a lot of reversals up in this pile. Okay, if as of recently you have not been feeling like being sexual, that's okay. <laughs> there is nothing wrong with that. For some of you, the reason why you're not feeling sexual is because your body is either overly tired or there's some sort of toxic habit that you've been doing that is lowering your libido. Everybody, it's kind of different, but it's like you need to hear that there's nothing really fully wrong with you. You're going to regain your sex drive. Also at this time, maybe this is just not a time for you to be engaging in sexual activity and that's okay. Sexual energy increases creative energy is the same it's as if you're harnessing your creative energy in order to birth a new reality instead of you know just releasing it or having it do whatever here there and everywhere it's like no now you're calling your power back to you in a way don't worry about it right now if you're not feeling the most sexual or the most horny your sex drive will definitely come back but there is a need for you if you have been indulging or engaging in any type of toxic habit to kind of check yourself and purify just a little bit just a little bit okay and just know that your money is definitely going to be increasing baby <laughs> as i look at this dice the song coming through is they see me rolling they hate tin. 
you know, people gonna hate. They gonna hate. It's all right. It's all right. Your spirit guides in the universe are really about to give them something good to watch the way you about to get blessed in front of everybody. When I say that table gonna be prepared in front of your enemies, baby, baby, it's going to be wild. The Cinderella story could be very significant and just the way that you've been working the way that you have been dedicated that shit is not going unnoticed by the universe the universe sees what you're doing sees the work that you're putting in and you will be rewarded point blank period you can expect positive change in your circumstances and whoever doesn't like it that's their fucking problem okay really anyone that was trying to catch you lacking about to catch you stacking okay so there's about to be some sort of good news in terms of your career and finances also if you've been learning a new skill definitely stick with it because that skill is going to be bringing you an abundance of money and it's something that you're really good at so continue to keep watering that seed within you baby and let's get it let's go so we have the seven of swords with the five of pentacles child universe we're here to gas people up no <laughs> i feel like this is about to be we about to expose some shit the way this shit just started off here okay hold on have you recently got ghosted or you felt abandoned and you're like why that truth is about to be revealed to you this person is coming back in to let you know why they did what they did okay if you want to accept this person's apology then that is completely up to you here honestly i really don't like this energy though because i feel like this person is coming back into your life once you have this immense glow up and all this wonderful change they're coming back when you're already happy and doing well without them and it's like you miss your opportunity get the fuck out of here so but if you do want to hear them out they're definitely going to be revealing a truth to you about why certain things played out the way that they did this person is giving that they have low self-esteem or they don't really got money like that but there's something for you but let's gas the viewer up Spirit, let's get it. Let's go for the viewers of Pal 2. Let's see what's happening here. Okay. Also, if you have any problems or any issues right now, you are definitely going to be having the money to solve those issues. So don't really worry about any money concerns right now or any problems because you're going to be able to handle it effectively now you really are the life of the party but somebody here fucked up okay back with this past person again i really feel like you need to hear the fact that this person was a player or they were just very unstable or childish definitely not on your level whatsoever this person could have put you in some sort of third party situation or they just lied about who they were they were wearing a mask spirit really does not want you to be sad about this situation there are bigger fish to fry there's better things to be focused on and based on the pile that you chose you will still get your happily ever after but baby don't be upset about this situation your energy kind of fluctuates here and there some days you're upset some days you're like fuck this person some days you are a little bit more sad about it other days you're over it you know your energy is a little bit all over the place when it comes to the situation but the truth of the matter is, is that you were not the problem and you are enough you are enough now it's time for you to just be in your bag and have the last laugh don't worry too much about this situation cry if you need to let it go if you need to definitely don't be competing over no man with another woman if that's the situation or the case here what you need to know is that this person is definitely going to be coming back for some communication or they're going to want to explain some things to you and they definitely do have feelings towards you but this is a situation or a person that you need to tread very lightly with in terms of your life and in terms of the changes that are about to occur for you they're going to be happening very quickly within the next few days to the next few weeks but this is a good time for you to focus more on what you do have in the present moment versus what is lost because whatever is lost or was lost is about to be replaced with things that are eight times better so that's what you need to know for real is that whatever is lost is about to be returned onto you tenfold and with the right people 
or with somebody that's not going to juggle you or just act like really childish towards you we're not with that childish shit now what i have to say about you babe is that you are a very easygoing person and a lot of people mistake your kind nature for weakness they feel like they could take advantage of you now i never want you to change your character continue to be you but be aware of people's intentions and people's motives towards you and if something feels off trust your instincts because that's definitely guidance and you're on point so let's get it let's go big changes are coming your way leaving them out in the cold because the truth is they fucked up and they know that they fucked up so let's not be forgiving of people who really don't deserve the forgiveness okay it's time to move on and move up exactly that shit's dead spirit is saying that that shit is dead and this person is also going to have to watch you get loved correctly so whoever hurts you child their karma is going to be that they have to watch you be loved correctly by another person and they're not going to have access towards you and it's going to hurt them even more because they are going to genuinely want and desire your affections and you're just not having that that's just not the way things are gonna go that's not the way things are gonna crumble here we are laying old shit to rest in this case in this situation it's a relationship with somebody who didn't act right when they had the chance to all right so this is a very specific message coming through and if it's not resonating then this is simply not for you my love but the person that hurt you is going to be feeling more hurt specifically after you are now letting go moving on and also living a very fun adventurous free life the fact that you're getting away is what is really going to hurt them. But the thing is, like I said, they know that they fucked up. They know that they did. Ooh, ooh. <laughs> so you definitely have some sort of new love on the table. Spirit is saying don't even communicate with this person. Like literally let it go. Cry if you need to. Mourn it if you need to. But this is not somebody to be allowing back into your life. And I will tell you why. The reason why is because this person will block your blessings. They were removed so that you could receive certain blessings. This person is not part of your good karma. They have different karma to receive. Whereas you are going to be receiving good karma and your life is going to be moving very quickly, very fun, happy-go-lucky type of vibes. Whoever it is that hurt you or fucked you over, your ancestors are not playing their karma is a little painful i'm not gonna lie and you're not here to save anybody okay so this is somebody that was a play a player that was entertaining other options and look speaking of karma we have the wheel of fortune things here are really changing for what was last is now first and what was first is now last Whoever was on the top is now on the bottom and whoever was on the bottom is now on the top type of energy going on here. And from what this is giving, it's giving that you were on the bottom and now you're being propelled to the top very, very quickly. And again, people counted you out. They wanted to hide you. They wanted to suck you away. And it's not just whoever hurt you, but haters as well haters are going to have to sit back and watch the universe bless you abundantly there's certain things in your life that are meant to be let go of at this time and if things are ending let them end because this is part of the changes so that new and improved situations and circumstances and people and more favorable outcomes can come into the picture so whatever is ending let that shit go and let's keep it moving. Let's keep it pushing. <laughs> Alrighty. Let's see. We also have the Three of Pentacles. Yeah, there was some sort of third party situation for sure that you were dealing with. You might be a part of this right now. And maybe you don't know and th this reading is your confirmation or if you've been having suspicion for others of you, you've already found out. The reason why this truth is coming to the light is so that you can move forward with your life. Not only move forward, but also move on to better.
you're also the top of your class in your work. I don't know what you do. Yeah, look at that. Five of wands, six of wands. You are propelling forward. Somebody didn't make up their mind about you and now they're getting left in the motherfucking dust. And whoever also hurt you, there's a lot of messages coming through. So my bad if I'm all over the place. But also whoever hurt you, hurt you this person likes to entertain hoes or they like to go back and forth with hoes. Let them do that. You don't need to be a part of that because the way that you're coming across, babe, you're way more than that. You're way above that. You deserve to be treated like a princess. You deserve to be treated like royalty. You deserve the utmost respect. Back to what I was saying, in your work arena, you are the best one to do it. You just get things done very seamlessly and you're about to be promoted because of the work well done and how you do things. Sometimes there is things that you're assigned to do with your coworkers or with other people and you're the one that does all the work. This is also giving group project vibes like when we were in school, maybe there's teenagers watching this, but when you know the teacher puts you in a group and then one person does all the work but like four other people slap their name on that bitch as well. It's kind of that energy but you are are the one that normally does all the work when it's supposed to be a group or a team effort and there's somebody noticing the fact that you are the one doing excellent work and you are about to be rewarded for that or promoted for that or just excel in your field because of the work well done and any other people that are trying to take what is rightfully yours are also going to have some sort of negative karma so whatever you're doing if there are people competing with you or there are people your peers that are watching Watching you work and trying to copy because of how you do it the innovation that you bring to the table so be aware of that be mindful of that but know that the right eyes the eyes that count are seeing you they're understanding where the original is not who the copycats are okay ciao this is a complex message you got a lot going on and you're also changing and transforming yourself. Also, you're not going to be operating from such a wounded place anymore. The things that used to hurt you or the things that used to bother you, they're just not going to matter anymore because your life is going to be so good and so exciting. So this is a time of clearing for you. And it's also a time of success. It's like as soon as you let go of certain things, certain identities as well, I definitely recommend that you watch Pile 3. Like as soon as you release, things just automatically propel forward for you. And you don't have to compete with anybody. Continue to do your own thing. Because like I said, the eyes that actually count, the eyes that actually matter, they are seeing you and the people that are in the position to propel you forward will do what they need to do in order to make sure you are at the next level. You are definitely up leveling and things are just going to be happening in your favor at this time. Any negativity, negative people, fake people, people that hurt you, people that couldn't make up their mind about you, you're moving away from all of those people very quickly and you're moving into a place where you're going to be more appreciated and again there is new love on the table for you as well also back to that beginning message if this person is still trying to have sex with you this person that hurt you or that's a player spirit is advising you against that because they might have an std because they do a lot of shit with a lot of different people so this is about keeping yourself healthy as well and if you feel like something's wrong definitely go and you know make sure you're good do whatever you need to do to make sure you're good okay baby so we got inspired action it says take action when you feel the desire follow your intuition and know that you are supported by the universe also to gas you up as well and then we have perspective you're definitely going to be gaining clarity and taking responsibility for your life i want you to know that you're not a victim and it's time for you to make moves for yourself and not feel that you are restricted by your circumstances because you're not and you can change at any point in time if there's something that you want to go for or something that you want to do but you feel like the thing that you're trying to go for is highly saturated at this time still take action on it because it's something that you are meant
meant to do and just know that you are going to be supported you're also going to trailblaze take time to sit alone and just think things through see ask for the different higher perspective i promise as you see things from a different perspective you're going to completely understand and get why certain things happen and one of my favorite questions to ask myself when I'm trying to see things from a different perspective is what did I learn from the situation? What is this situation teaching me? Every time I ask myself that question, I automatically gain a different perspective. So definitely do that. As you get the lesson, it will not hurt so much. And again, you're letting go of wounds. You're healing says no one is you and that is your power so yeah you're definitely special as fuck and like i said everything that you're receiving is literally for you and this one says you are strong enough to face it all even if you don't feel strong right now but you are strong so continue to hold your strength continue to have faith and just know all of this is going to pass way faster than you think and you will be the one having the last laugh cry if you need to cry and other than that i hope this was helpful if you would like a personal reading if you want to ask your own questions definitely hit me up this was one more that i really like actually it says you're a diamond sweetheart that's what all that pressure was for okay everything that you have been through everything that you've been going through it has been shaping you molding you into this beautiful version that is blossoming. You're gonna come out better than before. You're gonna come out more beautiful than before. And you're definitely an inspiration for a lot of other people. So definitely know that you are a diamond and also there is nobody like you. You're very special. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed like this video. Leave me red hearts if you watched all the way through and i will talk to you later and just know that hard times do not last forever they will pass and things will get better peace hello my love and welcome to your reading today we are going to be gassing you up and i'm pretty excited to do your reading i hope and intend all is well with you and those you love we're gonna go ahead and get into it i feel like with this pile i'm welcoming in a lot of new subscribers a lot of new people people that have never seen me before so hello hi how are you it's lit over here welcome to the party we're gonna go ahead and get into it i really like the picture that you chose there is a lot of eastern energy middle eastern energy and indian deities coming through with this pile so you definitely could be of a different ethnicity or you like to travel or you're just really into that kind of culture and also asian culture as well but literally you have a heart of gold okay the first thing people notice about you is how your heart is and how you have a different energy than other people that they've met the goddess kali is coming through for this pile and the goddess durga both of those goddesses are heavily coming through you have very strong ancient protection walking with you and your ancestors don't play also your body is very nice and you take very good care of your body you may be somebody who really honors your body as a temple and there's this very pure essence about you as well as you just radiate this kind of health okay you radiate a very strong sense of physical well-being and it's very attractive you are undergoing a identity shift i don't really want to say a transformation for you but this is more of you peeling back the layers and no longer identifying with certain things that simply don't serve you anymore and maybe the thing about these peeling back of layers is you were wearing masks in order to people please or in order to fit in and now especially with that kali energy coming through it's giving it's giving <laughs> that you're not caring anymore you're stepping into a more authentic version of yourself but it's because you are releasing these masks and no longer needing the approval and validation 
from others this is an internal shift that is currently happening and it's making you more attractive believe it or not your authentic self is your most attractive version and as you are being more and more you and no longer caring about what other people have to say about it you are emitting an extremely strong frequency that is felt by everybody that is in your presence and it is a feeling of love self-love self-acceptance and confidence you're also very hypnotic and you're very seductive naturally you don't have to try that's just the energy that you exude because you're so anchored and so firm within yourself at this time, this is like you taking other people off of the pedestal and you putting yourself on the pedestal. And because of that, your frequency and the vibes that you're giving out there are more magnetic and more attractive than ever. Don't be surprised when things kind of switch or shift where, where you were once serving somebody, you're no longer serving them and now they're serving you. Or if you were chasing somebody, you're no longer chasing and they are now chasing you you're not putting anything external on the pedestal anymore this goes for money as well if you were chasing money at one point or feeling like you needed money now that you're like ah fuck that you let go you released you detached now your detached essence and your detached energy is attracting everything that you desire people are very intrigued by you they want to know more and again this heart energy that you're radiating at this time is yummy it's fucking yummy and your heart chakra has been activated and also kali is working very close with you so that you can peel back these layers and become your most authentic version not only become and fully embody your most authentic version but love all of you all parts of you the good the bad the ugly the beautiful all of it you're loving all of it and you're owning all of it and integrating all of it and there's no more parts of yourself that you are tucking away or hiding so shadow work is involved in this situation lilith is also present here helping you to also fully own any fragments that maybe you put away or you shamed yourself for no more of that this is actually helping you to become a very powerful being and you should be very proud of yourself maybe there's certain aspects of self that you thought would not be approved of or people wouldn't like it or this that the third the truth is is that you cannot please everybody but that's not your job your job is to please yourself this is like you're getting rid of the fake shit and embodying the real shit you're dealing with shadows that may have been tucked away for years it could be a little bit of a painful process but as you do it you're becoming stronger as well as more magnetic and authentic so your authenticity is what is going to draw the best things to you, the things that are actually for you. So if people start to fall away or circumstances start to change in your life, things that you were holding on to, the reason why is because your new identity is not attached to those things and you're going you're caught you're simultaneously calling in the new with this new frequency okay so you are also becoming a very powerful manifester whether you realize it or not or whether you've been fully aware of it you're going to become more aware of it and start to manifest things that are more fulfilling to your soul and to your heart versus your ego some of you could also be reading the Tao at this time but you're really blossoming into the most beautiful version of yourself so keep going with this work it might have been more painful in the beginning but now it seems that you have really integrated and you're more comfortable with the process you're more comfortable with shedding the skin it's also reminding me of a snake where you know the snake sheds its skin and then it becomes a new you're simply shedding everything that no longer serves you everything that wasn't you as well false selves false masks things that you did just to please other people it's like no you don't give a fuck anymore and that is what is the most attractive thing so let's get it let's go 
All right, we have a positive pregnancy test. I swear these little binoculars came out in every pile. So my collective is definitely being watched. I mean, how could you guys not be being watched? You're so fucking beautiful and gorgeous okay of course people are watching they can't keep their eyes off of you and there's definitely something that you need to be cautious of or beware of you are fertile definitely beware of pregnancy especially if you're not trying to get pregnant because somebody's looking at you like they want to get you pregnant okay <laughs> yeah they want to fill your cup they want to fill your cup if you understand what i'm saying Clarify the heart in reverse, please. See, and then we have the three of swords on the bottom of the deck with the ten of swords. So there could have been a breakup here. Maybe you're healing right now after a breakup, focusing more on your money or focusing more on what's important to you in general, learning new skills. Filling your own cup. It's like you don't need anybody to love you. You can love yourself. That song from Miley Cyrus is coming through. I can buy myself flowers. There's a very heavy self-love energy coming through with this pile. And continue to love yourself. Especially if somebody wasn't loving you for the totality of who you are. Or if you haven't broken up with somebody yet. Maybe a breakup is in the near future. But the reason why this breakup is happening. Watch everybody click off uh, um, don't click off don't click off the reason why the breakup is happening is so that you could focus more on filling your own cup versus relying on somebody else to fill it for you of course you're being watched people are very drawn to you at this time they can't look away especially your eyes there's something really beautiful about your eyes people get lost in your eyes and you have a very beautiful face as well everything about you is very pleasing and you also have an exotic look to you you don't look similar to the people that you're surrounded by so you might live in the united states but you have a look like you're a foreigner or that you're from an island or that you're a little indian there's definitely an indian vibe coming through with this pile bali vibes i think bali's in thailand but yeah y'all exotic you're exotic boo and this is how people view you people view you as exotic as soon as people see you they're like where the fuck are they from like i know it's not here so let's hype you up a little bit more your hair is also growing people are noticing that your hair is getting longer maybe that your clothes are changing as well and that your energy is different your energy is definitely different for sure so let's get it let's go you could have been drawn to pile two as well i know the pile two people were drawn if you watch pile two hey it's giving that you're blocking a lot of people at this time cutting people off let's type the viewer up i can buy myself flowers write my name in the sand I can take myself dancing. Mm -hmm. I can love me better than you can. Mm -mm 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 -mm. All right. So I wanted to get all these cards out. You are definitely a certified lover girl or a certified lover boy, okay? It just oozes off of you. You is not with the hoe shit. Like, <laughs> you definitely are a lover for sure. And it just radiates off of you. You're also a universal lover where you don't judge anybody. You really do love everyone and you radiate love and you love god and you just radiate love for like the entire world and the entire universe and it's so unconditional this is a vibe that radiates off of you or this is a point that you're getting to in your spiritual journey at this time a breakup is definitely significantly coming through in this reading here this person still wants to be with you this person is still watching you this person wants to talk to you in fact you are going to be hearing for, from this person very soon now you've kind of moved on with your life but in a way where you're just really loving yourself you're loving your own company you're loving your own energy and your masculine and feminine energies are very much in harmony at this time but you operate from a very strong feminine place and it is 
felt as well as you just have this nurturing essence about you that is attracting a lot of romantic suitors so it's like as soon as you got up out this there okay there was people waiting for you and your boo to break up i don't know if you peeped but but people were definitely waiting for you to get single if you're in a relationship there's people waiting for you to get single people think that you are such a good catch to be in a relationship with there may have been some sort of competition for your love or there is competition for your love because of your energy and your heart just being a heart of gold and people really do notice and recognize this about you you have a very sexy look about you but it's your energy that really captivates more than anything so whatever self-love practice you got going on keep it up self-love self-care because it's literally making you the most magnetic person in any room that you walk into now your ex is still in love with you and they want you back they know that there is a competition for your love they know that you're not going to be easy to get back they view you as somebody that has moved on but they still feel that connection towards you and they feel as well that you're going to be open towards them now whether you're open towards them or not that's completely your business i want to do the nine of wands really quick clarify the nine of wands i also want to say the universe is a little bit in competition for your love because i'm getting this vibe with the tower card that was on the bottom of the deck that the universe purposefully separated you from others or put you in a little bit of an isolation phase so that you could work on yourself we have the empress your beauty unmatched top tier and i feel like anybody that ever becomes your lover is always going to be extremely loyal to you and always have love for you because there's nobody that's loving on the planet like how you loving okay your love is like <laughs> your love is like a drug yes but your love is literally so pure and so unconditional that it's unforgettable there's nothing like it it's very much your own you can't find it anywhere else it's one of a kind the universe now was even in a little bit of competition because they're like this is my baby <laughs> the universe was like this is my baby and i need to put get this person like the universe wanted to upgrade you in some way shape or form that's why you went through what we talked about in the beginning of the reading when i was channeling now you're going back out in these streets with this new and improved energy and frequency and baby you're getting all of the fucking hoes like everybody is like oh my gosh you need to have strong boundaries boundaries are going to be very important the universe understands that you're a very unconditionally loving person and you're very open and receptive that's part of your nature but this energy ain't just for anybody okay they need to be worthy so look the tower is right after the empress i didn't even view that not everybody deserves to be in your presence this is also giving star or celebrity energy you know when celebrities and stars go out they have like a vip section they're in public yes but they're they're secluded they have security this is you you don't need to be amongst everybody the queen doesn't you know socialize with the peasants type of vibe let's get more uh clarification about this nine of wands here i definitely see healing happening and to gas you up baby is that you're the shit you are the shit even though your ex wants you back maybe you're over it you're not having it anymore that's completely fine if you choose to get back with this person they would take you back open arms the thing here is that you have so many people that are in competition and fighting for your love and it's truly your choice who you want to give your love to who you want to give your cup of love to and if you don't want to give it to any of the people or any of the options continue to give your love to yourself continue to work on yourself because literally it is taking you far it is taking you into new planes of existence new divine activity okay and clarify this two of wands you have certain plans that are meant to be executed solely by you this is a good time to focus on those plans and make your moves in silence uh-huh and 
is definitely communication is definitely coming in so if you've been waiting for communication it's for sure coming and more love offers are coming too you're you're giving princess diana okay it's giving princess diana like the real princess diana and in the hood i'm like princess diana vibes that's what this reading is giving and your ex has definitely cried about you all of your exes they still feel the loss of you to this day because you just keep leveling up and getting better and better and better and you're somebody too where when you cut a motherfucker off you're done you're literally done and people know that you're not gonna put up with the toxic bullshit they know that so you have a lot of secret admirers you got a lot of stalkers or a lot of people who just like to like see what you're up to they like to see what you got going on a lot of people People in secret competition as well but you don't have to give your energy and attention to that you just you know follow through on your ideas follow through on your plans and continue to love yourself and do your thing because literally your reality is changing in big ways and it's about to get really exciting as well follow your calling and trust your intuition your mind is really beautiful, but definitely a whole new identity is coming. And also, you might be making choices that are healthier for you as well. Like healthy choices, no longer dealing with any toxic behaviors, toxic habits, toxic mindsets. You're really freeing yourself at this time. There's a lot of healing in this reading as well. Especially from love or just relationships with people that you put up with a lot of bullshit. It doesn't have to be just romantic, but platonic, family, that type of shit. No longer. Now it's like you're not giving your attention to other people. Now you're giving it to yourself and what's important to you. And that's what is making the world of a difference. Also these positive, healthy choices that you're making as well. Keep up the good work and it's been a ride i know it has been a long ride the universe is working heavily with you at this time as well as some of those other spirit guides i listed and just know that everything is going to be occurring in its right time don't try to control things this is an amazing time for you to kind of just go with the flow and be open and receptive to what life throws your way and the seeds that you planted know that they are going to manifest there's a process that that is occurring where you are shedding very similar to the seasons and the cycles when i'm filming this we are in winter this is also timeless so whenever you're watching you're watching at the right time but winter is very symbolic of death and then a rebirth and blooming happens in the spring so know that your spring is very near okay you've gone through the death the death is still kind of processing and then very soon those seeds that you planted are going to bloom beautifully. Things are going to be happening for you in a way that you wouldn't expect but it's all working out in your favor and there's definitely a twist of fate that is happening here so get excited. The universe is at your beck and call for sure. And you're also going to be hearing from some people that you haven't heard from in a while. They're going to double back. People are definitely going to be spinning the block on you and some of them are not going to have access. If you want to talk to them, you could talk to them but have those boundaries and know that some people are simply coming to siphon and take energy and you got to be aware of that if it's not equal then it's a no wow <laughs> hold on that flipped really far i'm gonna read it for you in a second but it flipped really far it says always give it a hundred percent don't have fast and you are perfectly imperfect so you are perfect the way you are exactly who you are right now in this moment you are perfect love yourself now and just know that it is not your job to be everything to everyone but be the best you for you so if you would like a personal reading you want to ask any of your own questions definitely hit me up i'm here for you other than that like this video subscribe leave me red hearts if you watch all the way through and i will talk to you later. Peace. Mwah.